Hello guys, how you doing? Me again. Um, haven't done an actual proper video in, in, in a few days. Um, I actually think that might actually be a few weeks now. I think I haven't done a proper, haven't done a proper video since uh, just before Christmas. But just before I went on my uh, Christmas adventure down to my parents uh, to obviously give them Christmas surprise. Um, there's been lots to talk about really since then till now. Um, Trump's now president. Um, we had all these women out in in force the other day, yesterday and the day before, um, protesting against Donald Trump. Um, we've had Theresa May hiding away from the fact that the Trident missile was left out off the chain and nobody batted the fucking eyelid. Um, bit of good news uh, to all my friends out there that took part in the ship to ship to ship oil transfer <coughs> protest. Uh, bit of good news that they've, they've stopped, you know, that, 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 that part of action and I believe that they're having to start all over again from the beginning, you know, go through all the relevant paperwork, this, that and the other. Trump's got more fat women walking in one day than Michelle Obama in the last eight years. Um, I think that's a kind of negative way of thinking about it, to be honest. Um, don't get me wrong, I, I, I do believe that, you know, Trump got a, a fair few women out on the streets than um, Michelle Obama has done, but you know, using that narrative isn't isn't really isn't really my thing. But yeah, no, I, I agree with you. You know, there were, you know, a president to rally behind, so to speak, even if it was for negative negative things. But yeah, like I say, there's been lots to talk about. Country's still going to shit. The world's still going to shit. The Israelis are still building on the occupied lands in Palestine. Still committing war crimes. Britain's still making weapons of, you know, I wouldn't say mass destruction, but it depends what you, you believe mass destruction is, really. You know, a bomb that could destroy two houses with, I don't know, potentially up to six, seven people in each house, I would see as mass destruction. Oh, thanks very much, Kevin. Thanks for all the likes and the thumbs up. How you doing today, brother? Um, but yeah, no, I just wanted to just to, to, to sit and correspond with you guys if if you're about and you want to chat. You know, there's a little box for you to type away in. Um, as you all know, all my videos get uploaded uh, from Facebook Live uh, to my YouTube channel, which is Gary Santa David. Um, it just means that I can broaden my, my audience, do you know what I'm saying? My 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 negative and positive love and all this shit. Um I would like if possible, you know, anybody on Facebook that's watching these, if you could send me uh, a list of events that are happening in Scotland, you know, this half of the year, do you know what I'm saying? The the first six months of the year. Um I wanna see how many protests I can get to. Because uh, near the end of the year there will be a bit of good news. Um, I'll leave you hanging on that bit. Uh, so obviously I want to try and get as much uh, fight the power in as we can. To change from the love and peace and the prosperity kind of side of me that I, I always do. Uh, I'd like to talk about direct action. Um... Because as much as a friend of mine, fellow brother, fellow member of the, the human race did just state in there, Trump got a few fat people out. I really don't like using that, but it does help to get my point across. Did anyone see how many people were there for, for the inauguration or whatever the fuck it's called? Quite a few. Do you see how many people turned out to protest against him? And I'm not just talking about in D.C., I'm looking at saying in London, Antarctica, 
you know, Italy, you know, foreign countries that aren't under, you know, American dictatorship. And just see what they were doing. You know, walking with their signs, screaming and shouting and using their voices. Could that not have been a perfect time to actually do something? Now, what actually stops us from walking into uh, 10 Downing Street and removing her by Theresa May by force? Nothing. Uh, I actually believe, and I've been told several times, that we could form a militia. I know that sounds really, really negative, you know, guns and all this crap, but it's, it's not like that. So try and bring justice back to our country. When we have people like Theresa May who won't answer the question did you know about the Trident missiles and you have the same person you know covering up or helping to cover up the the historic and horrific paedophilia rings you know do you do, do you just sit there and make a video it's all George Soros controlled they were paid also if you get into the frequency help motivate people to do things also, if you get in, into it, frequently helps motivate people to do things. I like to help people do things. I like to help people, you know, achieve their own goal. Do you know what I'm saying? Because we, all, as I, I posted yesterday, it was a, I believe it was a Viking picture. Uh, it's not okay for you to, uh, to expect everybody to conform to your ideas. But it's perfectly fine for you to have your own ideas. You know, I, I want... I, I'm, I'm sick of sitting here behind the camera. Oh, frequency as in hurt. Sorry, sorry. I thought I meant, you know, the vibe. Sorry. Oh, God, I need to get tissue. My nose is running like fuck. Give me a second, guys. Yeah, it's funny that. I have a tissue in my pocket. Um, But yeah... I'm sick of seeing my country. Well, I say my country. I don't, you know, claim ownership or anything. I, I, I'm not, you know, a Rothschild or or, or a lizard queen. Um, but I, 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 I hate to see my country in distress. Do you know what I'm saying? I hate to see the fact that, that you know, the poor, as they say, you know, it, it, it are being downtrodden. You know, I hate it. You know, it, it reminds me of, you know, the Victorian age. You know, obviously I wasn't around in the Victorian age, you know, I have to use my public education for that. Kevin, you'd know all about public education, remember our public education? Uh, but yeah, I, I, I hate to see, you know, my country in distress. I hate to see the fact that, you know, there's not a lot we can do, or, or we're, we're felt like there's not a lot we could do. Hello, Jack, how you doing? Um... But there is. There's a lot you can do. And a lot that you can do from sitting at home. Do this. You know, Facebook it, it now has adverts. Well, Facebook Live now has adverts on television and shit. You know what I'm saying? Let's, let's, let's form together. Let's, let's make something that we can all be proud of. Uh, let's make a, a future where we can all carve our own little part out and, and be happy. Because I know it's possible. You know, there's a friend of mine that I know that, that lives in the woods. You know, it's his choice. You know, I don't know how we went about doing that. You know, it's a fucking brilliant idea in my mind. But I don't know how we did it. I'd like to. You know, separate myself from, from society. You know. The, the next thing I'm going to say, most people may not like. Uh, because they have this Islamic phobia. Um, I was listening to an imam earlier on. And he was saying, if you accept, you know, Queen, Country, Theresa May, Parliament, that kind of thing, and accept what they do on a daily basis and the horrors that they, you know, achieve, then you're just as bad as they are by allowing it to happen. You know, I've never stood back idly and see, you know, people being persecuted. I've never, I've never stood by and allowed some individual to get persecuted for their views. 
regardless, I'd like somebody to actually stand up and, you know, help me when I'm being persecuted for my views. Uh, I believe one person watching this or was watching this has helped me. Jax, uh, she witnessed me on the high street be belittled by the Nazi regime called Police Scotland. Um, I'm not saying that because they're all like that, but the two that were in front of me were very Nazi, like, you know, just following orders, you know, kind of shit. But I, I digress. I, I, I talk. I've had a few, you know, comments on, on YouTube and on Facebook and that where I, I talk about a certain topic and I get into it and then I change. Uh, because my mind doesn't think like everybody else does. You know, one thought comes into my mind and then by the time that thought has been processed and ready to say, I've thought about something else. You know, I hate to see the way my country is run. The lies and and the shit that comes out from these people and the powerlessness or feeling powerless. It's not nice. I'm gonna leave the video there guys for now. Got lots I wanna say. But just not feeling the vibe today. Need my medication. So once I've had my medication, I'll uh, Get back to you guys. So as usual, from me, it's peace and love.